This is going to be a video tutorial on how to schedule an email to be sent out at a later date or time using Gmail. I'm going to jump over to my web browser here where I'm logged on to Gmail and I've started composing an email here. The way that you would uh, schedule an email to be sent out at a later time or date, at the bottom here you have the send button. Next to the send button there is a drop down arrow. You want to select the drop down arrow and then you want to select scheduled send. And then in the little di scheduled send dialog box that opens up here, it has several default options that you could choose from. Or you could select pick date and time and select your own date and time. The uh, default options are you know tomorrow morning at 8 a.m., tomorrow afternoon at 1 p.m., Monday morning at 8 a.m. You could select one of them or you could choose pick date and time. I'm going to select that. And then another dialog box opens up here, a calendar. Uh, say that I had an email going out this next Saturday at noon. What I would do is click on Saturday here. And then I would change the time to noon. So this will be sent out Saturday at noon, and then I'll just click Scheduled Send. And now in the pane off to the left hand side, there is a folder that says Scheduled, and it tells you how many emails are in that uh, folder there. If I select that folder, there's the email that I just composed and I uh, scheduled. If I want to alter this, if I want to alter the time, if I want to go ahead and send it now, all I got to do is click on the email and then off to the far right here you'll see it says cancel send I'll select that and now my email comes back up as if I'm composing it again right here I can send it from right here or I could select the drop down again and I could click schedule send and then I can go through the same process I could uh, choose one of their default options to send it or I could pick a date and time to send it. But that's how you schedule an email to be sent out at a later time or date. Thanks for watching.